welcome to today's video. As you can see, it's an amazing, super nice and sunny day here in Delhi. Which means I am super happy because I love summers. I am not a winter person and finally I can be in my half sleeves. Which you cannot see because it's too sunny. So yeah, that is how my day is. I hope you're having an amazing, amazing day. And today I'm coming to you with a new launch by Nyka. They've launched two new products today. You can see both of them on my Instagram, which is at PoojaMittal09. And I'm so sorry for this hammering noise. There's a construction going on next door and I cannot help it. Anyway, so I thought here on YouTube I can go in detail and show you what all products these are. This is not a sponsored video. I just got these products, so I thought why not share my opinion here? Okay, so the first product that we'll be reviewing today is something for eyes, and the next product I'll be reviewing tomorrow here, so stay tuned for that. The first product that we're talking about is Nykaa's Eyes on Me. It is a 10 in 1 eyeshadow palette collection. Yes, it's not a eyeshadow collection, it's a palette collection. They have a few eyeshadow palettes from this range. And this is of course the PR kit. So, okay, so these are all palettes. What I'm assuming is that because they are different themes, that means they have different color scheme going on. So one can completely choose the one they like. The one that I have on my eyes today is Sundowner Stunner. Let's open one by one and see how the palette looks like. The first one is called as Beach Peach. And uh, let's see. So as you can see, palette is full of different uh, peachy kind of shades. They also have some nudes in here which are great blending colors. And I'm happy to see that the brand has included a few shimmers. So if you are going out for a party but you want a uh, very earthy peachy kind of colors, then you can totally go for this particular palette. Next is Sundown Stunner, the one that I have on my eyes today. So there's a mix of earthy tones and a little bit of pinks. They have a few shimmers in here. Um, so then you can also find a little bit of burgundy touch in the palette, which is great. Then we have next palette, which is called as Daydreaming. And this palette, I'm assuming will be pink, let's see. Yes, it is. It has these gorgeous pink colors. I am super excited to try it. These colors, these bubblegum, these bubblegum pinks. <coughs> what is up with me? I cannot speak. These bubblegum pinks look amazing on the eyes, so I'm super excited to try this one as well. Next one is called Aston's Twilight, which of course we can guess is a purple palette. Ooh, I like it. It's actually surprising. I was hoping it's going to be all purple, but it is a lot of early tones with some. Blues, a purple, a green. This is actually a very pretty green. Uh, so that is that. And the last one is Smoky at 8. And this one, is it a darker palette? No, actually, it's pretty surprising. I really like the color selection of this one. It has some gold, some shimmers, a really dark color for, I believe, the outer corner. This one is, I think, more targeted towards uh, the night, like night makeup. But you can easily get a daytime look out of this as well. I think this one is my favorite color selection, like after looking at it. Now, each palette comes with 10 shades and what Nykaa is trying to do is they're trying to make a beauty wardrobe so that you can just pick out one palette and create the look that you want. You really don't have to add anything else uh, to the palette. So that is what the concept is. Also, every girl is inclined more towards one particular shade. Some girls like pink, some girls like, like smoky eyes, some like shimmers and some like you know early tones i am more of a neutral kind of a person so whatever you like you can pick up that particular palette that was my phone so you can pick up that particular palette and you don't really have to buy like one huge palette with 10 shades that you don't want to use and there are five that you like ways you'll save a lot of money in this talking of money it costs 599 let me just confirm yes each palette costs 599 rupees each palette is free of parabens it's very vegan it's quality free and it's dermatologically tested which is great and now we've spoken so much about the palettes let's see how to create this particular look so that you can see how the shadows actually perform
right so that was my little tutorial on the look that i am wearing today now this i'm wearing for like let's say a day brunch kind of a look but you can totally like rock it at night as well just put on a black dress some jewelry and you're ready to go okay so one thing that i like to mention is the palette has both mattes and shimmers so you can wear whatever you're feeling let's say today you want to be all matte then you can go for a matte look if you want to add shimmers you can do that as well as far as the performance is concerned strangely strangely matte perform better than shimmers and it's not the shimmer zone stick you can see i have a lot of shimmer going on i actually i think used almost the entire palette because i want to test it out so uh shimmers are sticking on with no base i had no base on and still the shadows are going pretty strong i have them on for i would say about 2 to 3 hours and i was out shooting like like taking pictures and stuff and nothing has smudged nothing has budged so it's looking pretty nice something i like to add is that i would have loved if every palette had one darker shade because you all need that one dark shade let's say if you're traveling you are out and you suddenly need to go out at night and you want to add something a little something to your eye then i am the kind of person who always reaches out for a darker brown or darker burgundy all right so here are my final thoughts my eyes on me palettes are pretty affordable they are very easily available they are super like sleek so you can travel with them very easily pigments are good the colors show up pretty well as you can see on my eyes already each palette has both the finishes so if you want a matte or a glitter finish you can go for any every palette has both um as you as i was saying mattes perform pretty well as well there's no kickback in the pan which is amazing you there is no fall out on the eyes that is amazing as well um the only con on i would i would just say it's a feedback that i would have loved if there was a super dark shade as well and that is the only thing that i would have added to the palettes otherwise if you are a night shadow kind of a person then i would say these are totally a steal um you can choose the color family that you like and yeah also another thing that i wanted to mention is that a lot of palettes always have either a lot of brights or a lot of dark shades or all the subtle shades so this palette has a good balance of blending colors overall colors shimmers inner eye corners so that is great yeah, i think what i'm trying to say here is that if you are an eye shadow kind of person and you do not want those big all palettes which have like 50 shades and you are always confused and you do not know what to use and you always end up using those four shades or you know the kind of person who likes those singles then this is something in between it has a complete eye wardrobe a complete beauty wardrobe and uh, yeah if you're not willing to spend a lot of money on the shadows then Yeah I would totally recommend going for these. All right so that is all for today's video. Comment, subscribe and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.